As we've said, President Trump celebrated his first 100 days in office today. He celebrated with a road trip to the heartland that put him in the White House. ABC's Josh Haskell was with the president. On the night of his 100th day as president, Donald Trump went back to Pennsylvania, where voters put him over the top on election eve. More than 100 miles away from Washington Swamp. Pointedly stiffing the annual White House Correspondents' Dinner, where Washington big shots dine without the president for the first time in 36 years. I think he's in Pennsylvania because he can't take a joke. Now. At a campaign-style rally with an overflow crowd, the president boasted he's gotten off to a roaring start. 100 days of devotion, hard work, and love for our great country. In fact, he signed 29 bills so far. 100 days of failure, 100 days of failure. Around the country, tens of thousands marked the milestone with protests over President Trump's climate policy. You can't get anything through Congress, and yet the Republicans control everything. The president faces his second hundred days with a long to-do list. His signature border wall is a campaign promise in search of funding. If the Democrats knew what the hell they were doing, they'd approve it so easy. And the Obamacare overhaul is still being hammered out in the House. And I'll be so angry if we don't get that damn thing passed quickly. But the president holds on to the hearts and minds of true believers. I think he's done a great job. If I had to give him a rating, I'm going to give him an A+. Plus. Room wasn't built in a day, and you can't fix the problems in a hundred. Josh Haskell, ABC News, Harrisburg.